give some people some minutes to jump on. Hi, Jacqueline. Hi, Amanda. <clears throat> so excited for this. I've missed teaching so much. Just the feelings I get from sharing this practice with others. So I'm so excited to be doing this this morning. I'll give some people a chance to jump on. Hi, Esther. So excited. Thank you for being here. Good morning, everyone. Happy Friday. Not that the day of the week really matters anyways. <sighs> so if you have um, blocks um, or toilet paper, two of the same size books, those could work as blocks today. Um, hi, Maddie. I moved my apartment around. You wouldn't be able to tell, but my couch is blocking my front door. But look, we have some space here. We're going to do it. <laughs> Um, you guys can all just, I'll have a start seated, so a comfortable seat on your mat or on the ground, wherever you are. So excited to have you all here with me this morning. Hi, Ronnie, Donna, Ash. So excited. Again, if you're just joining, if you want to use blocks, um, you can use books, two of the same size. If you can spare some toilet paper, um, you can use that. Uh... Yeah. All right, I'm gonna go over to my mat here. Can everyone hear me okay? All right, and then once I start playing my music, I'll just um, check to make sure you can still hear my, my voice too. Um, I don't want the music to be too overpowering. And then if you did um, pull up the playlist too, you can just kind of start it with me at the beginning, make sure shuffle's not on and it'll just run us right through um, till the end of practice. So um, for those of you who are just joining us, if you have um, two of the same size books, toilet paper, you can use those blocks. Um, this is a 45 minute class. The compass um, structure kind of goes like this. I'll walk you through um, two flows, three times each. So the first time we'll focus on alignment. The second time we'll focus on just moving with our breath. And then the third time you'll have the choice to flow on your own. So whatever that is that that means to you, whether it's the same sequence that I'll be doing or something else, um, feel free to take child's pose or just a seat at any time during this practice. Um, but yeah, let's get started. Super excited to have you all here. One second here. Okay. So we'll start seated here. <clears throat> you place one hand on your heart and one hand on your belly and close your eyes. So just take a really big inhale through your nose and then open your mouth, sigh it out. Good, first big breath of the morning. Do that again, big inhale through your nose. Feel your belly fill up and then exhale, sigh it out. Now come to some stillness here and notice how you're showing up today, how you might be feeling on this Friday morning. <clears throat> when everything is so uncertain. Go ahead and keep connecting to your breath here. Just grounding. Feel your sit bones ground into your mat. You're sitting tall. The crown of your head is drawing towards the ceiling. Your shoulder blades are relaxed. Unclench your jaw. <clears throat> Good. Keep breathing here. A couple more breaths. Of course, my music is not working here. That's okay. Oh.
Can someone just give me a thumbs up? Make sure you can hear me over my music right now. Perfect, okay. So you're seated, grounding down. On an inhale, reach your arms above your head. Let your palms connect here. Press all 10 fingers into each other. Reach up with your fingertips. Maybe look up here. And then exhale, press your palms down. Good. Inhale. Reach. Press your palms together. And then exhale. Press your palms down. Inhale, reach up, and then exhale, release. Couple more of these. Inhale, reach your arms above your head. Reach up with your fingertips, and then exhale, press your palms down. Again, inhale, reach up. This time, bring your right hand to your left knee, left hand behind you. Take a twist here. Okay, squeeze your belly button into your spine. Look behind that left shoulder. And then inhale, rise up. Exhale, release left hand, right knee, right hand behind you. Inhale, come up to center. And then exhale very slowly. Plant your hands on your mat. Move like you love yourself onto all fours. From here, shoulders over wrists. Tops of your feet pressing into your mat. On your inhale, you're gonna look forward, arch your back. And then on your exhale, look down, tuck your hips under, tuck your chin, curve your spine. Take some cat cows, inhale, look forward, arch your back. Exhale, look down, curve your spine. So start to take a couple of these on your own, just move with your inhales and your exhales at your own pace. For those of you who are just joining, we're just warming up our spine. <clears throat> Keep moving with your inhales and your exhales. A couple more times here. And then when you're ready, tuck your toes, lift your hips, and find downward facing dog. Let your ears come in between your biceps. Shake your head. Yes and no. Draw your heels down towards your mat. Unclench your jaw. Maybe stick your tongue out here. Shake your head. And then be still here for a moment. This first down dog of the practice. You can decide how it feels for you. On your inhale, look forward. Take some tiny steps up to your hands. When you meet your hands, bring them to your shins. Inhale, halfway lift so your spine is straight. The crown of your head is pointed towards the front of the room. Your gaze is just right over the front of your mat. Breathe here, press into your shins, and then exhale, fold over your legs. Good, inhale, rise all the way to stand. And then exhale, bring your hands to heart center. If you have an intention for today's practice, go ahead and set that now. Whether it be something physical, something you're trying to let go of, something you want to focus on. Whatever it is, set that now. Inhale, reach up towards the ceiling. Exhale, bow forward over your legs. Inhale, halfway lift, flat back. 
Exhale, plant your hands, step back to high plank. From here, again, shoulders over wrists. Puff up the space in between your shoulder blades. Come onto your tiptoes and then slowly lower your body all the way down, keeping your elbows tucked by your side. Untuck your toes, press the tops of your feet into your mat. Inhale, lift your chest, baby cobra. Exhale, release, tuck your toes, lift your hips, send your heart back, downward facing dog. Another one of these, inhale, look forward, walk, step, or jump your feet to the top of your mat. Inhale, halfway lift, flat back. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise all the way to stand. Exhale, bow forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Plant your hands, step back, and then lower down. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. One last sun A. Inhale, look forward, walk, step, or jump your feet. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Inhale, rise all the way to stand. Exhale, bow forward. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, vinyasa. Plant your hands, step back, and move through your vinyasa. All right, so we'll move into our first flow here. Find your downward facing dog. Pedal out your feet. Twist here with your core. 
and then release, low lunge. Drop that back knee, inhale, rise up, Anjaneyasana. You can keep your hands on your knee or above you. And then plant your hands, tuck your back toes, and then step it up to pyramid. Again, folding over that left leg. Straight, hinging forward. And then plant your hands, step back to high plank, lower down. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. This time we'll just move with our breath. Inhale, reach your right leg in the air. Exhale, turn open at your hip. Inhale, square your hips. Exhale, step your right foot between your hands, low lunge. Inhale here. Exhale, revolve. Reach your right arm in the air. Take a big inhale here. Exhale, release, low lunge. Inhale, exhale, drop your back knee, rise up, Anjaneyasa. Inhale here. Exhale, pyramid. Straighten that front leg, fold. Inhale here, exhale, high plank. Inhale here, exhale, lower all the way down. Inhale, cobra or up dog. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale, lift your left leg, turn open at your hip. Inhale, spray your hips, step your left foot forward, low lunge. Inhale here, exhale, revolve, low lunge, reach with your left hand. Inhale here, exhale, Anjaneyasana, drop your back knee, inhale, rise up. Exhale, release, pyramid, straighten that front leg. Inhale here, exhale, plank. Move through your vinyasa. This time you'll flow on your own. that is means to you. Go ahead and do that now. Facing dog, and we'll begin flow two. All right, let's do it. Okay, hoping my music is good and you can hear me. <clears throat> From 
downward facing dog. <laughs> Inhale, reach your right leg in the air. Exhale, step it forward, low lunge again. Pressing all 10 fingers into the mat. Really grab down here. Can you make this one deeper than the first round? More conscious of your movements and your energy. From here, press into your right foot. Let your left leg come up. Standing split, fold over your leg. Keeping your hips square, flex that left foot. Good, and fold. And then release that left foot. Crescent lunge. Inhale, rise up. Slight bend in that back knee. Shoulders are relaxed. Jaw is not clenched. Reach up with your fingertips as you draw your shoulders down. From here, we're going to step up to chair. Good. We're building heat here. You should feel this. In chair, really act as though you're sitting in your chair. Again, your shoulders are relaxed. Engage your core here. A couple more breaths. Bring your hands to heart center. Hinge forward. Twist to the left, hooking your right upper arm to your left knee, pressing your palms together as you're revolving. Take a couple breaths here. And then release chair. Inhale here. Can you sit a little deeper? And then exhale, bow, fold over your legs. Inhale, halfway lift, step back. Exhale, fold. Plant your hands, step back, and move through your vinyasa. I'm hoping that you can still hear me good. Perfect. Okay. Inhale, left leg lift. Exhale, step forward, low lunge. Good. Passing through your feet and your fingers. And then shift forward all your weight into your left leg. Standing split. Keep your hips square here. Flex that right foot. Maybe walk your fingers a little closer to your feet to draw your nose closer to your knee. And then whoop, release to crescent lunge. Again, slight bend in that back knee. Rise up with your fingers, engage your core here, and then step up to chair. Good, sit your hips, feel this heat. Welcome it with open arms. And then bring your hands to heart center, hinge forward, twist to the right. Press your palms together. Sit your hips. And then come to center, chair. Can you sit a little bit deeper? Exhale, fold over your legs. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Vinyasa. This time we'll move with our breath. Inhale, right leg lift. Exhale, step it forward, low lunge. Inhale here. Exhale, standing split. Inhale here. Exhale, crescent lunge. Inhale here. Exhale, chair. Inhale here. Exhale, bring your hands to heart center. Inhale, hinge forward. Exhale, revolve. Inhale here. And then exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, fold. Plant your hands, step back, and move through your vinyasa. Inhale, lift your left leg in the air. Exhale, step it forward, low lunge. Inhale, here. Exhale, standing split. Inhale, here. Exhale, crescent lunge. Inhale here. Exhale, chair. Inhale 
out of here, bring your hands to heart center. Exhale, hinge forward and twist. Inhale here, exhale, fold. Inhale, halfway lift. Exhale, plant your hands, step back, and move through your vinyasa. This time, we'll flow on our own. Let's do it. in front of you. Allow your brow bone to just come onto your mat. Maybe massage it side to side. That's good for your sinuses. <sighs> Catch your breath here. Thank yourself for showing up. Getting your heart going, your body moving. Getting you conscious of your breath. Stay here for just a couple more breaths. My AirPods are not staying in because I'm sweating. <laughs> yeah, so let me just make sure we're all good here. I'm sweating too. <laughs> all, right, all right, so <sighs> when you're ready, Come on to all fours, and then find downward facing dog. We won't be here long. And then you're gonna take some tiny steps up to your hands so that you can come to a stand. We're gonna do a little bit of a slow burn here, um, and then we'll do some core, and then we'll just cool it right down. And yeah, get my music going again. This AirPod does not want to stay in my ear for whatever reason. <laughs> okay. So you're at st you're standing at your mat. On your mat, okay? Clasp your hands behind your lower back. So if your shoulders are tight, that's okay if your hands can't connect. If this is just what you have, that's okay. Just connect your hands. Okay? So you're clasping your hands. You have a slight bend in your knees. And you're grounding down through your heels. Okay? So keep grounding down through your heels. Sit your hips a little bit more. Okay? Now with this bind with your fingers, hinge forward. Okay? Like you're peeking over a pond almost. Like you're peeking over a pond. Okay? Still your weight is going into your heels. So your fingers are clasped, you're peeking over a pond, 
your weight is in your heels. Now slowly, you're gonna break your hands free and bring them to a hover. And you're gonna slide onto your toes and balance here with airplane arms. Find your balance. Right, so you're balancing on your toes, squeezing your shoulder blades together, still peeking over that pond, but now your weight is in your toes. Gaze over the front edge of your mat. Welcome this heat again and the tremoring. Can you bring your pinkies towards each other? Just try. It's hard. Can't do it. <laughs> Good try. It's just building heat. And then release, fold over your legs. Good, we're gonna do that one more time. So clasp your hands at your lower back. Spine is straight. Start bending in through your knees. Weights in your heels. Okay? I don't know why I keep saying K, okay, like you're gonna just say, okay. <laughs> but, okay. <laughs> bending in through your knees. Weights in your hips. Slowly hinging forward, weights still in your heels. And then slowly. Break your arms free, drawing your pinkies together, shift onto your toes. Engage your core here, peeking over the front edge of your mat. Couple more breaths here, you can do it. And then really slowly come to a seat on your mat. Just plant your feet and drop your head right in between them, right in between your knees. So just be here for a second. Cool down, cut your breath. <clears throat> we have some playful core to do, so let this be fun. Um, we will ground down through our sit bones here. Reach your fingertips out in front of you for boat pose. I'm gonna turn my music up a little bit, so hopefully you can still hear me. From here, find boat. So your core is tight, your feet are flexed, and they're pressing the front of the room. You're reaching with your fingertips. You're gonna inhale here. Core is tight again, and then exhale, release to the mat, and then inhale, come back up. Exhale, release, inhale, crunch. Start to get a rhythm. If you want to keep your hands on the ground and just lower like this, you can do that. If not, let's crush 10 of these. Go. Four, three, two, one. 
drop to your feet, let your head come down. Are we sweating? Are we feeling good? pigeon here you'll feel this in your left hip keeping your both of your feet flexed will help you really get deep into this pose um, so just feel yourself calming down here and let your hips open we'll play a little Trevor Hall all in due time I think that we can all relate to this song as of right now and as you're just letting your hips open, together, knees out wide, hands, one hand on your heart, one hand on your belly. 
Listen to me here. Feel your back melt into your mat. Like it's here to hug you. Like it's here to comfort you and make you feel a little less alone during this time. So know that you can always come to this practice if you are looking to slow down, to breathe, to let go of something, to tune into yourself, to feel centered. Turn your cheek, turn your left cheek to the mat and let your right cheek come to the skin, come to the air. And close your eyes and pretend like someone is giving you a kiss on your right cheek. And then turn your head to the right. And feel as though someone's giving you a kiss on your left cheek and telling you they are proud of you for everything you're getting through at this very moment. Slowly bring your knees together. Let your feet come out wide. Come out in front of you, palms up. Receive this practice. Receive this hug that your mat is giving you. And relax, Shavasana. Namaste, this feeling we're all in this together, we're showing up, we're holding space for each other. Continue to just take some very still, calm breaths. Roll on to your right side. And then slowly bring yourself up to a seated position. And keep your eyes closed. Bring your hands to heart center. Bow your head here. Thank you for 
for taking the time today to show up for yourself and to move and breathe and connect. I'm so grateful for this practice, so grateful for the Compass community, for just everything that, everything that, that is here right now. I'm grateful for it. <laughs> so thank you for being here. I really appreciate it. Um, bow your head. The light in me honors and sees the light in each of you. So go off today and continue to make good choices for yourself, for your mental health and your physical health during this time. It's so important. And I love you all. Namaste. <laughs> Have a great day. Of course.